Good morning, good afternoon, good evening everyone. This is Marcos and this is the fourth part of the Prisoner of War gameplay. So, uh, I actually <laughs> did a part, I've tried to record this uh, already today, but uh, uh, I found out that I don't have to do what I just did, which is uh, steal another Braski because it just happens to be in my own pocket. So what we'll do is just uh, get the documents, which is our uh, objective right now. And uh, yeah, still the documents. So uh, they did recommend to get the uniform. And this should be pretty easy actually to get. So I think if I remember correctly, it's, it should be right here. Actually very close from the go. Okay, let's st quickly steal it. Okay, come on, come on, come on, come on. There we go. Okay, we'll knock here. Okay, come on. And then this actually makes it a whole lot easier. You can only do this from a uh, from level 2 and upwards. There we go. Oh no, and I see the controller I'm using. I might not be able to walk, so I'll have to do, uh, walk very... Oh, you can even hear the, the analog stick down. Anyway, we'll just have to play it like this. Oh no. I wish I could use the other controller, but... Uh, Unfortunately, it's broken right now. Oh, I don't even know I can. Uh, I mean, I completely forgot I can. I can turn the those. I don't know what they what are called the gate things. Okay, and we have to go over there. <laughs> Let's see what they're gonna say. Since I have the uniform. Sir, not the sky, sir. <laughs> oh, it's sir, this guy. Me and my friends have orders to help you out, sir. But the boy has decided we shouldn't do it. Can y'all give us 25 currency? Sorry, sir. Uh, not right now. I think I'll be able to do this without him. Okay, uh, we can't open the gate, this one, but uh, we'll just have to climb, climb over. They don't even use anything to open it, it just opens, so I don't know why the game doesn't allow us to open it, anyway. We have to go over, oh no, we have to go over there, and there's gonna be this uh, blue guard. Oh, and I think he can recognize us actually, so we have to be careful. Even though we're wearing the uniform, he can still recognize us. Okay. Let's try this. It has to be super, super quick. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay. We got inside. And now there should be the... Oh, the chef's... He's not here right now. Maybe he will be, hold on. I know he does come over here. Oh, and you actually get some currency here. And we're gonna go up because there's some items as well to steal. And there's no guards up here. So I think this is the mini telescope. Yep. Uh, some of the items you actually have to carry uh, as they're heavy and you have the animation where uh, it looks like you're like that one but uh, a nice iron key and I believe you can use the telescope on uh, on on this yep yeah you can use it quite nicely Oh, you actually have to bring it with yourself, you can't, uh, never mind. Okay, so, Commandant's building. 
that's where we have to go and did the music just glitch out okay oh no and he's right there and he'll be able to recognize us as well so I don't know how I think we have to wait wait for him to to go so we'll just we'll just do that okay he, he went right there okay I think they switch between okay, is he coming back or, or what okay we could have done that right there Um, come on. Okay, well, we'll still there. Right come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh. Okay, we got it. And don't wait for him to. Okay. That was surprisingly uh, easy. But the harder part is going to be here to get back. Although, with the German uniform, everything's easier right now. I really can't be bothered using the boot polish, so we'll just. Okay, so he's coming. So let's wait. Okay, come on. Oh, I'm still getting stuck. Okay. Come on. Ah. Oh. All right. And I think we'll just go straight to the to to the officer. Right after this uh, mission is done, we'll save. And I think that'll be it because the next one will be much harder to record. And we might fail if I don't finish the recording after this. So, yeah. Okay, where is. Uh, I don't remember where they are. Are they inside here or. The major with the. Let's see. Oh, there he is. is okay. That you, sir? <laughs> Jolly effective disguise. Jolly effective. <laughs> all right, sir? Jolly good. Ask the way. Forgot the plans. I think it is about time you showed me the answer. Oh, front, Jerry, sir. We'll have a tin way back at the backs. As we suspected, Wing Commander, Jer is using this camp as a cover for a weapons research facility. Mm -hmm. Looks like they're assembling a long-range rocket. A rocket that could strike at virtually any city in the world. Oh God! Right under our noses! No wonder they bunged you in the cooler for snooping around. No. Any idea how far they've got? This schedule suggests they could begin testing as early as this winter. What's this man doing here? This is a British operation. Well, not any longer, sir. I beg your pardon? What's your name, Alan? Most British of you, Colonel. This is Captain Stone of the United States Air Force. He retrieved the plans after your uh, unfortunate encounter. Colonel Harding here reports to the Special Operations Executive in London. Thank you, ma'am. Oh, well, I think the general is going to come. Huh. Oh, he has the uniform in his hand. It's General Star. Yep. Star, he's bad news. We we'll have to move fast. Hey, 
Major, did your radio boys get that transmitter up and running? Just did not, sir. Good. We simply must fill in Whitehall. And while you're at it, have one of the chaps make a copy of these plans. Better say I'm sorry. Please just change. Double camp security and half the prisoners food rations. There will be no further transgressions. Okay. Double the guard is utterly tough. Have a transmitter be patched up, Major. Not for not, sir. We are off the air permanently. But at least the guards failed to find a copy of the plans we made. Perhaps we could smuggle them back to London through the, uh, the, you know what. The tunnel? Sir, we cannot afford another betray. Oh, calm down, Major. I think we can trust our American friend by now. In fact, look, sir, it's like this. Some of the men have been working on a tunnel in preparation for a mass escape. What say you tag along and take the plans with you? You bet. I got a score to settle with this Gerald Stalk. And I'll bet he'll have a real bad day once the big wigs back in London find out what he's up to. Very well. The ventilation in the tunnel is still insufficient. We require something to drive the air pump. A set of bellows would be ideal. Perhaps you would be so kind as to fetch some for us. Okay, that's it. Thank you for watching this video. We'll, uh, I guess we, we don't need to store these because uh, they don't make the animation where it looks like we're running. So, uh, thank you for watching this, everyone. Uh, we'll see you in the. I'll see you in the next part, and that's all. Thank you and take care.